Welcome to IGN. We get paid to play games here. Tough job, I know. More than 30 million gamers swear by us, so we make sure to know the must-have games and gear for the holiday season. Whether you're an experienced gamer, a first-timer, or just shopping for that special someone, you've come to the right place. Plus, we're bringing you a world-exclusive cinematic trailer for Mass Effect 2, 2010's first major video game release. So give us 30 minutes, and we'll give you the world of gaming. This is Game Break, IGN's ultimate holiday video game gift guide. Now from IGN World Headquarters, here's Jessica Chobot. Okay, folks, we've got a lot to cover, from recommendations for every type of game to the best new gear. For the beginner, we'll give you everything you need to know to get started, or pick out the perfect gift for the gamers you love. We'll get the action rolling with the best action titles. Our favorite new action title is Assassin's Creed 2. Parents, you should know that the violence in this one is very realistic. Gamers, the violence in this one is totally realistic. Punch Out! Yep, the boxing game that dates back to the arcade and original Nintendo is back. Once again, you can beat up ethnic stereotypes like wimpy Frenchmen, burly Canadian lumberjacks, and magical turban-wearing Indians. It's exclusively for the Wii, which means you can play by waving your arms around in the air, but we prefer the traditional thumbs-only method. From Pong to Pac-Man, the early days of gaming were filled with memorable characters, but none more popular than a short Italian with a mushroom fix. Mario is still alive and kicking and better than ever. The latest installment of the world's most prolific game character is here. And for the first time ever, four players can play on the screen at the same time. That's right, the whole family can play. It's smart, it's imaginative, it's Mario. Next on the docket are role-playing games, better known as RPGs. For you newbies out there, RPGs differ from action games in that you take on the role of a character and build their strength and skills as you progress. Long ago, games like this were called Dungeons and & Dragons and they were played by kids who got stuffed into their lockers. But now, rock stars. One of our favorite new RPGs is Ion. It has some of the most beautiful graphics and landscapes we've ever seen. The overall world in Ion is a bit limited for our tastes, but this enabled developers to pimp out every other aspect of the game. If you're not up to speed on the latest version of Madden or NBA Live, you're probably old enough to remember when sports were played outside with an actual ball. Seriously? They used to do that? 